Hi, my name is Jonathan Gustafson. I'm excited to introduce to you today what we call the genealogy section of Family Search. This is uh, just a tremendous opportunity for many people in Africa and for many people in the Pacific Islands. Family Search uh, over the years has been collecting oral histories, oral genealogies uh, in Africa and in the Pacific Islands as well. Now we have a spot on our website where you can search those oral genealogies. I'm going to take you through that experience and show you how to do it as it currently exists. And I'm excited to share this with you. My name again is Jonathan Gustafson. I'm an experience manager, product manager on the African Heritage segment here at Family Search. OK, let me share my screen. Let's jump in. OK, so what we do is we go to familysearch.org. You'll see this here. And for this, uh, what we'll cover today, you don't even have to log in. So you'll see across here in familysearch.org the diff the menu, and we're going to click on search. If you'd like to follow along with me to see these oral histories and perhaps find your family, you can click here. Currently, we have about 20 million names in the oral in the oral genealogies, and these are primarily in Ghana, uh, Africa, and in Nigeria. OK, so we're going to click on search. You'll see the menu here, uh, the genealogy section. That's where we're going to look at these oral genealogies. OK, so you can see here, this is the search form. You can search, uh, it says search genealogies. That's what you're looking for, search genealogies. And you can search by first and last name, you can search by a variety of events, like if you know when someone was married or where they were born or where they where they passed away, you can do that. If you know their relatives, you can do that. Again, we're on the search genealogy section. So just a quick review how we got here is we started family search, clicked on our search menu, clicked on genealogies. And we get to this form now. One key thing on this form is to click on collection and we're going to select just the genealogies so we can search all these different things, but we just want to search for our purposes today in the oral genealogies because again, Family Search has sent people uh, in about 15 countries in Africa to go face to face and collect oral genealogies to meet families and elders and leaders and to uh, record their family history, their family lineage and genealogy. And this information is here. OK, now that I'm going to search in the genealogies just to show this to you. Clicked on search and you can see here a number of results on the right and you can see here on the left a number of ways to filter this. So. For today's purposes, we're going to just go right in and, and look at some of these genealogies. You can see here that it shows the name of the person of it, an individual in the genealogy, an event associated with that person. So uh, Akua here was born in 1957 and it has the location Ghana, uh, Ashanti in, oh, and Kumasi, okay. And there are a variety. You can see some of the relationships. Uh, uh, Akua here's mother is Akosua, and here's his father, Kwabena, and so on and so forth. Okay, I'll just scroll through a few of these so you can see. And we'll pick one at random here. Okay, this is now we are on one of the genealogies. We're right on the genealogy. You can see here on the left uh, a portion of the family tree. I'm going to zoom in just a little bit. Maybe we'll zoom back out and make that a little easier and just zoom in on the tree itself. So the person we zoomed in on is this person here. Their children are on the left. Uh, their parents are on the right grandparents as we continue farther out and you can keep clicking if you like. Now at the top here is information about the individual, excuse me, about the interview. So this is the 
interview information. And this is the tree of one of the individuals in the interview. There's additional information here on the far right. I'm going to scroll down just so you can see. This interview has 740 people this, uh, that are in this oral genealogy. OK, so let's learn some basic information about this oral genealogy, some foundational information. So it's done in Ghana. It's the genealogy of Enyarkoa. So this is probably the first ancestor. We'll just double check that in a second. This is who uh, gave the genealogy, and this is the range of the people listed in the genealogy. OK, we'll click on more here so we can see, oh, the interviewee, the person who got interviewed, and their first ancestor, Enyarkoa. That's important. This is who everybody is, uh, descends from. We can also see the, the tribe and the language. So the tribe here, uh, these folks are Fanti, and this interview was done on uh, in 2009. Uh, additionally, uh, some of these interviews, some of these oral genealogies have documents associated with them. It's usually a list of everybody in the genealogy. So we'll open that and we'll look at that. OK, so this is going to be a PDF that contains 22 pages. You can see that of people whose names were collected in this genealogy. And it starts, you can see here the number one ID number one. It's a little small, but it starts with the first ancestor and goes on down. So Enyarkoa was a woman. We know that because it says female here. I'm just going to zoom in a little bit if we can. OK, Enyarkoa, and um, then it just continues on generation by generation. And if you have additional questions, uh, there is more information about this, but I just want to make sure that you could see that. And if you'd like to download this um, and have a copy of it, that's this button right here. So back to our introduction of the oral genealogies. OK, so. What we saw was uh, one individual in the in this oral genealogy of the 700 plus individuals. If you would like to see everyone uh, who's in there, one way was to excuse me. One way was to click on uh, that PDF and many of the interviews do have this PDF. And another way is to come down to the very bottom on the right. You see, I can I'm scrolling down here and there's this place that says submission ID. And if you click on that, it will take you to every but everybody who is in this oral genealogy, all 740. OK. You can scroll through and look through them. That's certainly one way to see them. That's a way to get it. That's a good way to get a list of them. As is this PDF, if, one, if there's a PDF there. Now, these same individuals are in this tree. OK, so. You can see here on the left some of the youngest. And you can see the children, some of their children. We're moving on through the generations here. You can see this generation's children. And this generation's children. These people were born in the early 1900s. Moving on back. We get all the way back to Enyarkoa. So let's click on Enyarkoa and their children. And here they are. And we can select any of these. So Enyarkoa, uh, look, we'll click on Ekua this time. And this information will now show us information about Ekua here on the right. So Ekua was born, the estimation, estimated birth was 1899. Here's their name. Here's her name, excuse me. And where she was born. And uh, the fact that she's deceased. Her parents and spouse are not known in this case. Tribe and clan. And so this is uh, the oral genealogies. Let me just jump back out again. Just a quick, quick review as we as we finish up here. So what we did was we came to FamilySearch.org. 
we did a search. We're looking for the oral genealogies. We search here. And then if we want to, we input information here. And we select our oral genealogy collection just by way of review. And then this pulls up our results. And let's, in this case, just as we wrap up, let's put in an ancestor's name and search for them. And let's assume that they were born or lived in Ghana. We're going to scroll down and do that search as we're doing our quick review. So we searched for Kofi Addo in Ghana, and we found a number of results here for Kofi Addo in Ghana. And if we were to select one of these and click on them, well, before we click, let's just notice this person was born in 1997, and here's parents, and here's the village and the region uh, that he was born in. We'll click on him, and then here's the information about the interview. Up here, let's close that. Here's Kofi Otto's tree. We could trace that back. And here's the information about Kofi Otto and his parents. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for your time today. It's been a pleasure to speak with you. Again, my name is Jonathan Gustafson. Hope you have a wonderful day.